Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome back. Today we are looking at the new mods for Farming Simulator 2019 on the 20th of July. Well, let's get into it. Alrighty, so your first new mod for all platforms, we have a Seasons Geo Georgia. Do you want to play like you're in Georgia? Well, you can play like you're in Georgia with the Seasons Geo for Georgia. Alright, let's move on to your next new mod for all platforms. Alright, your next new mod for all platforms is Seasons Geo North Carolina. Do you want to experience farming in the productive soils of large state in the middle region of the USA? The latest version of the Seasons mod is required. Let's move on to your next Seasons Geo for all platforms. Alright, your last Seasons Geo for all platforms today. We have Seasons Geo Holland. Do you want to, would you like to feel right at home playing in Hollingsfield? Well, this Seasons Geo would be perfect for you. It's fully generated on real life data and will be close as possible to the real thing. In Holland, it is mostly warm. Sometimes it spills the rain throughout the day. Hope this geo suit is suited for you. Enjoy. Let's move on to your next new mods for all platforms. All right, your next new Seasons Geo for all platforms is Seasons Geo California. Are you ready to farm in a large state of California where it is very hot? Hot. You can also expect droughts and dry climates based off a of town of Willow Creek. The latest version of the Seasons mod is required. Let's move on to your last Seasons Geo for all platforms. Alright, so your next new mod for all platforms today, we have a Polish Shed. This, okay, to find this, you can go into Placeables, Sheds, scroll, 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 scroll. It's at the end for me, it's $5,000, you can place it. It says it stores agricultural machinery, but nothing will fit in here. Look at this. Your own person probably don't want it. Don't fit in here perfect either. So yeah. All right. Let's move on to your next new mod for all platforms. All right. Your next new mod today. We have a lizard water. This is a homemade water transporting ca capacity of two thousand liters. It can, you can do the color configuration and the price is $500. This is pretty cheap. To find this, go into animals, plate tools, animals, scroll, oops, right there. There it is. You can change the color to, rim color to anything and the main color to anything, so, yeah. The only color that does not change is the tank. Alright, so let's move on to your next new mod for all platforms. Alright, your next new mod for our platforms, we have a Hangar 03. This is a metal shed for, se for season, ready for seasons. Price of $5,500 and a daily maintenance of $5. To find this, go into placeables, sheds. Don't scroll too fast because you'll miss it. It's right there. You can place it. There you go. Ooh, nope. Alright. Let's move on to your next new mod for our platforms. Alright, your next new mod for all platforms, we have the Cow's Barn. This is a cow's husbandry in an European style. The price is $100,000 to $200,000. Daily upkeep of $90. Capacity of 1,200 cows. Or 100 to 200 cows. Season trading and support from the newer system. There are two versions. There's that version and then there's one without the pin. So, let's see. Let's throw some cows in. There it is. I find this just going to animal pins. Right there. There they are. Alright. Let's move on to your next new mod for all platforms. For all platforms. Alright, your next new mod for all platforms is a Lizard MQ-12T trailer. Now this is by 40 modding. It's a trailer that holds 
14,500 liters and a price of 14,250 liters. To find this, go into store, tools, trailers, and there it is. It has a lot of configuration, drum colors, there, just do them like that. Main color can be got each of them colors. Design can be those colors. What does the design change? What's yellow? There's something that it changes, I just don't know what. And then you can do a lot of, a lot of changes. And the wheels change. And then the wheel setup can change a little bit. The design can change. And so can the registration to like anything you want. Alright, and let's go and look at this one. Alright, your last new mod for all platforms. We have the old trailer. Now this one is priced at 2,500 liters, capacity of 4,500 liters, and the wheels can just change. Once again, go into trailers, and there it is. Just the capacity changes, but bale loading wagon or grain call, grain hauler, and then the wheel setup can change. That's it for that. All right, so let's move on to your updates for PC and Mac. I mean, for all platforms. Alright, so your first update for PC, we have the Rissish RD180, price of $26,500, capacity of 17,200 liters, and I mean the change log is version 1.0.1.0, .1 fixed weight and fixed capacity. Alright, so your next update for our platforms is a Strop Mem Bundle, this is change log 1.0.0.1, .0 .0 .1. It fixed the diffu diffuse texture of the SDK, fixed position for bell support, drop side back wall foldable, and um, fixed shot pictures and icon has changed. Alright, let's move on to your next update for all platforms. Alright, so your next new update for all platforms is a Lizard D50D55 pack. This is change log 1.1. New colors, tires, and sides, and improve the textures. Let's move on to your next new update for all platforms. Alright, so your next new update for all platforms is the Lizard D46 D47 pack. This is change log 1.2. New colors, tires, and sides, improve fill volume, and improve textures. Let's move on to your next update for all platforms. Alright, your next new update for all platforms, we have the Lizard D633 pack. Or D633. Change log 1.1, new colors and tires, attacher, configuration, improved textures. Let's move on to your next new updates for all platforms. Alright, your next new update for all platforms, we have the new Holland T7AC series. This is change log 1.1, new tire configuration, fix various bugs, new sand, and new configuration just for design. Let's move on to your next new update for all platforms. Alright, your next new update for all platforms, we have the BGA 200 kilowatt. This is change log 1.1.0.1 and it just trigger corrected for maneuver. Let's move on to the next BGA. Alright, your next new update for all platforms, we have the BGA 100 kilowatt. And this just change log 1.1.0.1, .1 trigger corrected for maneuver, same exact thing. Alright, let's move on to your last update for all platforms. Alright, your last new update for all platforms, we have the Osborne Bull. This is change log 1.1, added three new small versions. Alright, let's move into new mods for PC and Mac. Alright, your first new mod for PC and Mac, we have the Bell Manager ID. Well, it's Bell ID Manager. It is possible to create bells on other farms without having to join them. And then I'll just leave all that. You have single player mod is inactive. You have to be a multiplayer for this to work. Alright, let's move on to your last new mod for PC and Mac. Alright, your last new mod for PC and Mac today, we have the True Mag RBTW. The RBTW round bell transporter is from True Mag picks up round bells, wrapped or unwrapped, with a diameter of 1.3 meters to 1.8 meters. Due to its low weight to only 80 kilograms, 800 kilograms, it is particularly suitable for hilly terrain. This will go great with the Alpine expansion coming up. It is recommended to place the round belt in a row beforehand 
in order to be able to collect them faster and more effectively. The price of the RBTW for four round bells is four hundred four forty hundred four thousand four thousand four thousand dollars and for five is a price of five, six thousand dollars. Okay, to find this, just go into tools, bailing technology. Here I'll have to scroll a while. Here they are. They're at the very end for me. You got this one. You can change the design color to blue new or blue old. And the red, red old, red new, blue. Yeah, same exact things. And then you got the same. Yep, yeah, exact same thing with this one. So let's move on to your updates for peace. I mean. Yeah, your updates for PC and Mac. Alright, your only update for PC and Mac today, we have Measure. And this is just change log version 1.0.0.3. New name in German and script improvements and bug fixes. Alright, so that is it for today. Thank y'all for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And have a great day, guys. Peace.